Hey guys, welcome to new video. In today's video, I'm gonna do some video which uh, you ask. From time to time, I see uh, that uh, somebody uh, put uh, pretty often put a comment about uh, industrial brushes. And uh, in my uh, one of my last videos, when I buy some stuff on a scrapyard and junkyard. Uh, I cross about these these big industrial brushes you see there is some copper inside I already cut that copper wire and uh, I just take a one take home test that and I find some silver present inside not maybe too much but I got that silver inside that brushes uh, so uh, second time when I go to that uh, scrapyard, I buy the rest of them from that big big motor So I already start to crush that You see in this pan I got some copper wire from inside see that and uh, There is a red Particles and there is also some white particles. Of course a lot of graphite is there It's very hard to crush that for that purpose. I just use this is big big uh, Heroic pump from the tractor uh, I changed that Before some time on my tractor. So I use that for uh, the green some stuff. Yeah, see very nice heavy stuff so I put that inside and crush some stuff like a rock or something uh, similar like this. So it's very hard to crush that. So I need uh, first I need to uh, crush on the smaller pieces. Then I bag that inside. Then I hit with a different tool and uh, I green that in the small pieces like this. Okay. First, I need to break that one by one. So, okay, uh, I know that this stuff contains some silver, but I don't know how much. So, I will just crush that, bring that, put that in a, on the scale to see how much weight we have. I will try to remove that copper, small copper wire, and uh, after that, I will go with the uh, the root nitric acid. So I use 56% uh, nitric acid. So when I do when I do that, half water, half nitric acid, it will be about 25-26% nitric acid. Uh, I will add distillated water just because uh, I want to save some nitric acid. Okay, uh, to cover all that. So uh, this video will probably not be a profitable, but no matter, I will just do that because uh, I love to work, to, uh, to make experiment with the different kind of material. And of course, I buy nitric acid much cheaper than you. So it's always worth for me. Uh, okay, so let's green that.
Okay guys, so we are almost on the end. I wash this silver a couple of times. You see our silver is in metallic form. So I will transfer that silver right now in this pot and uh, I will heat that. I will dry that to put that on the scale and uh, I will melt that later. Just I want to know how much we got from this from this industrial brushes, okay? Okay guys, so today I am kitchen chef and uh, I dried that uh, silver, elemental silver and uh, right now I will transfer that in the beaker, put that on the scale, okay. Okay guys, so I transferred that silver here in this cup just uh, transfer that easy when I start uh, when I start to scale that so dry beaker scales on on zero Okay. Thirty two point six gram. Yeah. Over the ounce of silver, not bad. Thirty two point seven point six. Never mind. Over the ounce silver. Very, very nice. So, very very nice amount of silver from that brushes. So this is refined silver and the, it's very pure. So 32.6 gram of silver from that amount of brushes, not, not bad. Okay, I am satisfied, it's not too much nitric go. In the process so uh, it is profitable on the end okay so guys I hope you like this experiment and uh, I love when I have some reward on the end of the any experiment in this case I got an ounce of silver so once again hope you like this video and some of the next one I will uh, recover some other precious metal from the rare stuff until that say scrap may gold have fun and uh friend out cheers